Hello, my name is Mark. I'm the vicar of St John's and St Mark's churches in Clacton. And as a church, we love to get involved with things in our community. And we love to welcome people in from the community to different events that might help them, like our Little Fishes parent and toddler group, like our special services, like our monthly lunch club that we hold here in St Mark's. And it's been great over the last few years to be able to welcome some people who CAP has been helping to these special events. One of those people was Sarah. She's written about CAP and explains how being a lone parent on maternity leave, she got into debt and couldn't afford the upkeep of her child. But she describes CAP's treatment of her as incredible, compassionate, always being greeted with kindness and reassurance, the start of a beautiful friendship. She met with Ronnie, our local CAP worker, and with Caroline, a befriender who's part of our congregation. Here's Caroline now. Now, why do you think it's a good thing to be a befriender with CAP? Um, it's really good to be able to uh, uh, help out someone who's in trouble and offer them the extra support that a local church can offer and also to just get to know someone new. Excellent. And then how did things go when you met with Sarah? Really well and it was great to get to know her a bit better um, as she came along to our toddler group which I help at called Little Fishes and I, I got to know her and her daughter um, a bit better as she came there uh, uh, over the um, following weeks. Okay, and is there anything else you want to say about CAP? Um, I think it's a really great initiative to help people out who are in financial trouble, especially at the moment when so many people are in um, financial difficulty. Well, thank you very much indeed, and thank you for all you've done as a befriender. Sarah finishes off by saying this, Thank you God, and thank you Christians Against Poverty. The road to being debt-free with CAP is an incredible journey, whether you believe in God or not. We hope to be part of that journey as a church and meet many more people and welcome many more people like Sarah over the coming years. Thank you.